Happy Thursday. Hello. I'd like to welcome you on behalf of Kyle and myself to joining us here at uh, Weekend Update, mm -hmm. Mac and Cheese Production. Yes. It is the Thursday before Memorial Day. Memorial Day. We've just been chatting about yeah. what Memorial Day is about. Yeah. You know, a lot of people confuse uh, Veterans Day and Memorial Day and don't really know the difference. They're just my thing. And what do you know? We found some stuff on our friend, the good, Internet. Good old Internet. Good old Internet. What do I think the difference is? What do you think is? the difference is? Well, it sounds like, to me, Veterans Day is specifically military. Memorial Day, maybe not so much. I yeah, yeah, I kind of got that, too. The, the, the quote here says that Memorial Day is actually used to be called, Memorial Day was called Decoration Day. Ah. It was about decorating the graves of people who had died in nation service, which I think would include policemen, firemen. Absolutely. Anybody, who, you know, any civil servant or government worker who died in service in their country. And whereas Veterans Day, which was originally called Armistice Day, Day that's like the you said, was formed in 1918 to honor those fallen in World War I and people who actually died. Mm -hmm. And it was about, no, I'm sorry, who served. Veterans Day was about people who served, served in World War I. Died. And right. in 1975, it was actually uh, changed to a national holiday for all those people who had served in the military, dead or alive. And there's a reason it was November 11th, and that's what people don't remember. It's November 11th, 1918, was the day that we signed the armistice for World War One, and it ended. Mm -hmm. That's the reason it's November 11th. And why did they change it from Armistice Day? Why did they After World War II. Okay. After World War II, they decided that they wanted to honor all people who had served in all American wars. And they said, hey, we already got a holiday. Let's join for And did you know that it's supposed oh, to be a three-day weekend? Really? Yep. It was one of the original four. It was ah. Memorial Day, Labor Day, Fourth of July, and Veterans Day. But since it moves, they can't do the three-day weekend. Nice thing, though. Gr growing up, my birthday's on November 10th. Hey, November 11th. So I always have the day after my birthday off. Of, oh, cool. You get a party? I get a party. Get party big. So November 10th, party Kyle time. <laughs> That's what we just wanted to talk about. Burger. You know, when you're uh, celebrating Memorial Day, remember what it's about. If you have some uh, you know, family or friends who are, you know, killed serving their country, you may want to go to their grave and put a wreath on it. That's the standard way to celebrate Memorial Day is decorate the grave. Decorate the grave. That's the memorial. Mm -hmm. so, or just there's supposed to be a moment of silence. I know that you know you're you're a big NASCAR fan like me, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, my dad, that. my dad is. <laughs> well, it'd be uh, Coca-Cola 600 which right. is this weekend oh, okay. at Charlotte. They are going to observe a moment of silence for uh, our nation's. Uh, well, I mean, it's about as much as a veteran. But people no, who not have, necessarily. People who have died. People who have died. died the service of the country it doesn't have to be military. So we're talking about, you know, police, firefighters, uh, you know, military too. Now that you're completely confused, now that you're, we thoroughly scrambled your brain. We really just want to tell you, on behalf of Kyle and myself, we want you to say have a great, great Memorial Day, Day weekend and see you next, next Thursday. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye-bye. What part didn't you understand? The buh or the buh? The buh. Buh-bye. Buh. Buh-bye.